And then the T-Rex came, scaring everyone! Rawr! <laughs> yeah! Dinosaur! Rawr! Did you hear that, George? That must be Daddy! Surprise! Surprise! Wow! A house with wheels! <laughs> That's right! It's called a motorhome! And we are going to use it to go on a camping adventure! Yeah! yeah! This looks like a very fun camping site. Shall we set up our motorhome? Yeah! yeah! Is that a hammock on the roof? Yes, Peppa. Daddy Pig or I can sleep up there. Where will George and I sleep? Let's do a tour of our motorhome. Follow me! This is your bedroom. OK, so there's one hammock and two beds. That makes three. But there are four of us. There's not enough space for everybody. Ah, <laughs> well spotted, Peppa. But we haven't finished our tour yet. These benches can be turned into a bed so there's enough space for everyone to sleep. I love our motorhome. It's magical. <laughs> it is. How about you and George go and play outside while Mummy and I finish setting up? <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, can you please tell us a scary story? Now that it's night time, it will be doubly scary. Well, I've heard that this camping site is home to a very creepy spider. They say he... Whoa! <laughs> oh, seems I'm not very brave when it comes to telling scary stories. <laughs> OK, George, how about you tell us a scary story? Dinosaur! Grrr! I've changed my mind. That's too scary, George. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's enough scary stories for tonight. I know what we could do instead. Some stargazing. Well spotted, George. That's a shooting star. Make a wish. Some of the stars make shapes, like those ones. They look like, well, they look like me. You're right, Peppa. A group of stars that make a shape is called a constellation. Who would like to see the constellations in the sky more clearly? Yes! So you set it up as so <laughs> and peek through this part at the sky. <laughs> ah! Oh my! What is it? <laughs> Silly Daddy, it's only a tiny little spider. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy, what do you think George wished for earlier when the shooting star passed by? Was that? Hmm. I think I know what George wished for now. 
Tasty, isn't it? I wonder if Pepper and Daddy Pig will end up eating it all in their special ice cream truck. <laughs> <laughs> ice cream, ice cream, come and get your yummy ice cream here. Oh, not so fast, Pepper. We need to set up first. Flavors of ice cream look so yummy. Oh, they sure do, Peppa. Which one would you like to try before we open up the shop to customers? Strawberry, please. Coming right up. <laughs> oh my! Looks like we have some customers, Peppa. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Hi, Susie. Hi, Mandy. Hi, Peppa. Could we please have some ice cream? Of course you can. You're our customers, Mandy. <laughs> Why don't you both choose which flavour you like the look of? Ice cream, ice cream. Yes, George, there is lots more. You just need to wait for the ferris wheel to finish spinning. Mm. Thank you, Peppa. Uh-oh. Whoa, it's raining ice cream. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry, Pedro. Don't worry, Mrs. Pig. I love chocolate ice cream. Mmm. It's okay, I'm all clean now. Good. Why don't you come with me and George to our ice cream truck? A whole truck filled with ice cream. Yes, please. Peppa, I didn't know you had an ice cream truck. Yes, Pedro, and the ice cream is delicious. Oh, ho -ho. George, would you like to serve our next customer? George? Yeah! <laughs> and now you can give the cone to the customer, George. Ice cream! Ice cream! <laughs> oh! Oh, Pedro, I'm sorry. George loves ice cream too much to be an ice cream seller. Hey! I have an idea, Pedro. Oh, my goodness! What an excellent idea, Pepper. This will test all of our ice cream making skills. Pedro, hold on one moment, please. OK, Peppa. One, two, three, four, five! Wow! That's the biggest ice cream I've ever seen. It's going to get as tall as the ferris wheel. 17, 18, 19, 20. Phew! I can't believe it! A 20 scoop ice cream! I don't think I'm ever going to be able to finish this. Ice cream! Ice cream! Don't worry, Pedro. I know somebody who would be very happy to help. <laughs> Today, Mummy Pig is doing a big spring clean of the kitchen. One sponge, one brew. I'm ready for the big clean. Dinosaur. <laughs> I can't play with you right now, George. Sorry. 
We'll play with George, Mummy. It just rained and there are muddy puddles to jump in outside. OK, Peppa, but don't forget to wear your boots. Boots. <laughs> and please take off your muddy boots when you come back inside. <laughs> uh oh, maybe we should go inside before it starts to rain too much. Good idea! Let's play hide and seek around the house. But not in the kitchen to let Mummy clean. <laughs> wants to count. <laughs> OK, George, count to ten. <laughs> oh. That was quick, George. Uh-oh. Wait a minute, those over there aren't my footprints. <gasps> You're so good, George. Oh no, Mummy isn't going to be very happy. What are we going to do? Mummy is using the broom and sponge in the kitchen and we need to clean this mess quickly before she notices. <laughs> Maybe we can find other things to clean with around the house. Good idea, Susie. Let's look in Mummy and Daddy's bedroom. <laughs> it looks like they're going to need a little bit of help. George, you wait for us here while we clean the muddy footprints around the house. <coughs> now, we just need to clean the bedroom and we will be all done. <gasps> oh no! What's going on in here? Oh! We're sorry, Mummy. We forgot to take our shoes off like you said and try to clean all the footprints. But George decided to clean in his own way. It's OK, Peppa. This is a good opportunity to learn some cleaning techniques. Let's do this together. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> well done, team. There's a little surprise waiting for you in the kitchen. <laughs> you did a really good job cleaning in the kitchen, Mummy. <laughs> cleaning is easy with the right tools. Wait a minute, you were cleaning with the sponge and the broom earlier but we found them in the living room and in mine and George's bedroom. You hid them, Mummy. <laughs> You're not the only one who likes to play hide and seek. Who's excited about seeing all the animals at the petting farm? Oh, me, me, I am. Me too, me too. <laughs> Uh-oh, it looks like it's going to rain. Good thing we brought our raincoats, Daddy. But the animals 
in the petting farm don't have raincoats, will they mind the rain? Hmm, I'm not sure, Pepper. Hopefully we can keep them happy with all of the food we brought for them. It's a shame there aren't any fish at this petting farm. They'd be very happy. Oh, look! The chickens like the rain. Oh, they're getting very muddy. Oh, no! He doesn't like the rain. Hmm, it looks like you're right, Pepper. Yeah! <laughs> oh, my! It was lucky I was wearing my raincoat, wasn't it? Ho-ho! Oh, I have an idea. Come on, Pepper. I need your help getting things from the car. What are we doing, Daddy? Well, Peppa... Oh, that's a great idea, Daddy! <laughs> oh dear, I think the rain is getting heavier. The animals won't be happy. Don't worry, little animals. You will all be dry in no time. Oh, that's better, I think. Oh, yes. <laughs> what do you think, Mr. Guinea Pig? And how about you, little chicks? It looks like all that jumping in puddles made George and the chickens very sleepy. Ho <laughs> 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 oh, So who enjoyed the petting farm then? I did, I did. Even though it was a bit wet. Oh yes. And would you look at that? Just in time. Oh dear. We should have made a raincoat for the car too. <laughs> Do we really need to wear all this sun cream, Mummy? <coughs> yes, Peppa. The sun is shining very brightly today. Right. Who's ready to go to the bit? Have you put on your cream, Daddy Pig? Ahem. <clears throat> um. <coughs> well, now I have. It's time for our adventure at the beach. Here it comes, George. <laughs> <laughs> oh, welcome to your very own castle, Prince George and Princess Pepper. Wow! <laughs> wow! Don't worry, George. Sand castles aren't supposed to last forever. Let's make our own. This smells yummy, Mummy Pig. Thank you. It's so hot today, it feels like we've all been on the barbecue too, Daddy Pig. Oh, don't worry. I have just the thing to help cool us down. Fancy's cooling down in the paddling pool. Me! <laughs> this is so yummy! 
Ho, ho, it certainly is hot. <gasps> Daddy Pig, look at you. You're bright red. <coughs> Mummy, why do crabs bury themselves under the sand? I imagine it's to keep out of the hot sun, Peppa. Oh, 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 uh, be careful. Oh my, it is rather cool down here. There you go, Daddy. That will keep you cool until we go home. <laughs> Good work, Pepper and George. I'm very proud of you. What an adventure today has been. Oh, I'm stuck. Here it comes. <laughs>